there's but cannons flying at you. Yeah, 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 yeah. So here we are on day two of the gaming. Uh, about coming up to half past twelve, half past midday on Sunday. And oh, there's been so much happening. It's hard to keep up. Um, but to briefly summarise, here on the main central table, uh, we've got the Allies with the Prussians closest to us, who've been doing a good job at keeping the French at bay. And there's been battling over the hamlet you can see closest to us here. Uh, and that hamlet is, he says, reaching for a sheet. Uh, that hamlet is Zifazain. Can you see that? Zifazain. There we are. And Liebervoltwitz. And then Wachau. And over in the third, far distance, you've got Markleberg. Okay. I'll put that down. So the Prussians here. In Zifat's own, keeping the French at bay, the land bear have actually done a sterling job. French cavalry and Wittenbergers have just come onto this table from the back table. And so, Melvin, have you just beaten the cavalry charge with my artillery? You bounced the cavalry charge with your artillery. There we are, folks. So that brings you bang up to date. The, 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 most, the most recent development. Uh, then, <coughs> further over, you can see uh, Liebert Volkwitz there in front of Andy, where there's still a lone Polish battalion holding on in Liebert Volkwitz, taking on all comers. But uh, the Allies have been sweeping around either side of Liebert Volkwitz. Um, just beyond them, though, you can see the taller buildings of Wachau, where the French young guard have managed to break in and thrown out the Russians in no uncertain terms. Uh, the Russians had a little disaster there uh, with um, John there behind Wachau, making some of the most spectacularly bad dice rolls we've seen all weekend. Uh, and then you've got French reinforcements piling in behind the young guard there. And then over in the far distance towards Markleberg, uh, you've got the French with masses of heavy cavalry. They've been making some gains there against the Austrians. The Austrians have been having a really tough time. But there are a few Austrian reinforcements coming in way over on that far flank in the west there. Meanwhile, on this back table, on this back table, let's have a look here. You've got the French who formed a defensive line along the river with, uh, this is uh, Prussian and Austrian light cavalry coming in. They've found a way around the flank, but they're not going to get anywhere against a defensive line like that. We've got French light cavalry waiting in the wings here. Moving further on, we've got uh, French artillery. Of course, they're shooting across the gap in the centre here. They're, they're shooting across the gap in support of the poles. And then behind us here, we've got... Oh, they look familiar, don't they? Yes, that's the old guard, French old guard. Grenadier à cheval, Empress Dragoons, Polish Lancers, Chasseur à cheval de la Garde, and that looks like Swiss Guard. Marines de Garde, Guard Grenadiers, and they're looking to sweep in as a reserve between. Robbie Rodgers' massed heavy cavalry here. Say hello, Robbie. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Move, move, move. There we go. Oh, this bit of the young guard, so they've made amazing progress there, actually, thanks to some dice rolling by John over there. Just a riot scheme. Massed French heavy cavalry taking on massed 
Austrian and Russian heavy cavalry. Well, they were, but I just think uh, there's been some excitement, excitement here, lots of to and throwing in here. Well, the moment you're affected by guns, so you have to move out of the way. And finally, over there, Mikey Bear. And we still have a massive Austrian traffic jam over on the back table there behind Karen. And so finally, let's have a look over in this corner where the Austrians all oh, have not had much luck and they were making progress across the river but have been thrown back. And my latest information is that this entire Russian core here is in deep, deep trouble, is not going to be making any headway whatsoever against the French who just managed in the nick of time to. Stabilise the line here I keep them up there. to prevent themselves getting badly out of flight. So there we are, ladies and gentlemen. That's our latest five minute update on the progress of the game so far with the French hanging on, making some progress still over here on the right, but on the left and centre, they're really under severe pressure. Ha <laughs> ha!